Hi guys, today's food of focus is Irish moss or sea moss. Technically, it is not a moss, it is a seaweed. Now, how did I come across this? I've heard of Irish moss growing up, my heritage is Caribbean, and there were drinks made from this stuff, and it consisted of having milk and sugar, and it was kind of gloppy and goopy and slimy a little bit, and I just never liked it. It was just not my cup of tea. Now, some years back when I had a hair analysis, I was just so dire in trying to find things that will nourish me fully, completely, and sea moss came up again. Now, sea moss has 92%, not 92%, sea moss has 92 of the 102 minerals that's needed for optimum health in the body. So then I was like, okay, you know, I'll drink this stuff again. I didn't like it before, but I'll drink it again. But the version that I had was the dry, crumbly one, and you had to boil it in water, and it got slimy, and I'm telling you now, the stuff didn't smell too good. But you like for nutrition, you'll do what you need to do. Somehow I couldn't stomach the stuff. I revisited it again, and then I realized I was drinking the wrong stuff. Okay? Now, I'll show you a picture of the other one a little uh, later. Optimum nutrition and nourishment nourishes all systems in the body. And a beautiful side effect of that is glowing skin, hair, and nails. And not everything can come in the form of a pill. Yes, we take vitamins. Yes, we have ground powders to supplement. But the goal is to eat as much food as you can, nourishing food from the food in its natural state, minimally processed. Imagine you want to eat an apple for its vitamins, its live enzymes, and someone gives you an apple pill or an apple pellet. That's not going to work. Or a salad pill or a salad pellet. Where's the enjoyment in your food? Where's the live enzymes? So most of our food needs to come from the food in its natural state, and then you supplement with your pills and your powders. This same seaweed has been reported to help varicose veins, inflammation, strengthens connected tissues, strengthens hair, skin, and nails, swollen joints. This, this seaweed is loaded with a natural form of iodine. For those who have thyroid conditions, please everyone do your due diligence before you consume anything and run it past your doctor to see if he approves. This is nature's natural form of collagen. This is vegan collagen. I am not particular to drinking any beef bone broth or any type of animal broth or soup to obtain collagen. As we're getting older, you want ease of joints, you want, you want ease of movement within your body and natural lubrication within the body. We have to feed ourselves, nourish ourselves with natural sources of these nutrients in order to have well-being. And in having well-being, it will be reflected in our physicality. It will re be reflected in our spirit, in our mind, mentality, just in our overall being. Trust your beauty. All right, let's get to work. Let me be very honest with you. Whoo, this thing is rank. It rank, it rank, it rank. I had to boil this. You could mix it in juices. I could not get this stuff down. It smelled and tasted that bad. Very fishy, fishy, fishy. Uh, hey. This is old. This has been sitting in my cupboard for years. Okay, saved it and look, it's a perfect example to use here. Get it in its whole shape. This is so processed. It is baked, it is dried, it is processed. This is not what you want to consume. It's better to get the whole seaweed. That's just minimally packaged, processed. It's been dried out and it's in salt. Okay, so this is what it looks like. This is roughly four ounces. 
if you see anything that looks strange <laughs> you pluck it out you throw it out when i say strange you know you're going to have a little bit of grit is salt you're going to soak this overnight and you're going to have to rinse it well now notice that you'll see you'll start to see like bits and pieces like this this is just part of nature it's not going to kill you if you feel funny you get rid of it you will have some discoloration see what it looks like it was in the ocean okay i'm going to drain out the water Okay, so it sat for 12 to 24 hours. Let's see how this set up. If you notice, it is translucent looking and we're going to rinse it. So we get our colander or our strainer. Dump it, dump it out. And we rinse. And rinse. And rinse. It's going to be a little slimy. And we rinse. And we rinse. And this is what it looks like when it's all finished. twice, double, triple, quadruple its size. Now we put it in a blender. You're going to need a high-tech blender to grind this up. This in our container. And we are going to fill this up with water like up to this point. You could always add. All right, let's check it. it. Should look like the consistency of applesauce. Less water, it'd be a little thicker and stiffer. But if you notice, it is smooth. Very smooth. We're going to put it in the fridge and let it set up. Okay, so we've let our sea moss gel set up and this is what it looks like. It's a thicker consistency. It's kind of gelatinous. Hmm. This is what it looks like. Now, what do we do with this stuff? You can put it in soups. You could use it to make uh, nut cheeses and I put it in my smoothies as we see here I have some blueberries radish sounds crazy but it tastes good ginger strawberries and chia seeds this thing here is soaked chia seeds I'm going to pour some goji berries that has been soaking for like five minutes And some of this sea moss gel. Now you notice it's not pouring as easy as it was before. Sometimes it sets up kind of thick that you have to scoop it up. When it's like this, it's easier to blend up. When you have it more of a jello-like consistency, then you have to grind it up in the blender. You just can't just pour it in your juice and say you're going to drink it because it'll get lumpy and it'll be a little bit slimy. But you put this in your smoothies. This will grind smoothly. When it's chunkier, you most definitely have to grind it up. Now I'm going to add some kale to this. 
add a little bit of water and grind it up. This is some good stuff. Trust your beauty and own it. Peace.